Tom's cutting out discs of supermarket sandwich bread. But it suddenly occurred to him to double-check his choice with his more experienced rival. Do you find with summer pudding in it, you've really got to use white bread of this, don't you? Yes, but the only thing that that bread's useful for, actually. Tom's dunking the white bread discs in the sweet berry mix. They'll form the top and bottom casings of his summer pudding, which goes with the shortbread and whiskey ice cream. This is the tricky bit, not to break the bits of bread, because they soak up the moisture. Ah, oh, delicious they look. I look at all, I mean, I added no water to this. We just pop the bread in, press it lightly, and it just, as it expands, it'll soak up like a sponge. Is this the sort of thing you make in, in your kitchens then? As soon as the summer starts, I have to be honest, this is a standby, I've always got to make yeah? it. Yeah? Yeah, I mean... It's a bit of a hit, is it? Well, well, I like it. Yeah. <laughs> and I, I, I force it on my customers. Slightly this unconventional chef's got his own method use, for forcing the puddings into place. No, I've just got to... You are a bit of an unorthodox cook, I think. <laughs> You learn this in your classical training, do you? <laughs> yeah, grab the chopping board. I mean, it's heavy. It's it's lo heavy. As long as it fits in the fridge, I'm OK. <laughs> it works. Yay. Yeah. Charlie, I want that in the fridge and I want more weight on it. Okay, the miniature please. summer puddings now have to chill for an hour. Meanwhile, across the work surface, okay. his friendly foe has been making the jam for his raspberry souffle. He started by carefully crushing raspberries by hand. If you put the raspberries in a food processor or in a blender, it, it, it cracks the, the seeds and then he reduced the berry juice on a gentle heat to intensify the flavour. What's going on? This is the jam. I've reduced it down. It's really nice and thick. Yeah. So we'll take that off the heat, but I need to add some sugar syrup to it. And so the last thing I'm going to add to this is a little bit of uh, eau de framboise, which is raspberry liqueur, and a little bit of corn flour, and in that goes very quickly. That's the jam ready. Are you confident in this pudding? Do you think it's going to beat Tom's? I, I have no idea. I really like his food. I think it's... A good food. And we're both exactly the same ice cream. Yeah, ex well, exactly the same. Well, I, I could toast it on me, yeah, yeah, he, okay. he, he doesn't. Um, he might, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the, it's time to change. Funny you should say that. Uh, Nick's raspberry jam is set to one side before it goes into the souffle.